this video we headed off to Tamworth for the Northern New South Wales Welsh Show up at Alec, which is a fabulous venue I've never been to before. This is one of the covered warm-up arenas and Reese is having a bit of a ride on Friday afternoon after the eight hours spent in the float to get there. And he travelled really well. We took a friend with us and her horse for their first show, which was nice. We had a lovely weekend, although we were only showing on the Saturday and it was a very, very long day and much warmer than we were used to. It's Bango's first time in an elevator in his 13 years, which led to many more times over the course of the day. This is Lily's. Um, and Reese's first class of the day. This is Led Welsh D Gelding. It was his first time ever in an indoor arena, fully enclosed. The closest thing he's been in is the um, covered warm up area in Sydney, and he was a little bit buzzy about it all. But anyway, um, his coat looks terrible. He looks absolutely awful. If it was a enter on the day show, I wouldn't have taken him. But. It wasn't and we were planning on going so we went anyway and yeah he just looks awful he was clipped in June for winter activities most of which were cancelled anyway because of floods but yes his coat just hasn't recovered he never fin hasn't finished dropping it he looks absolutely terrible so we were pretty much just making up numbers especially in the lead classes so they won reserve champion lead Welsh D gelding out of those classes before he got second in his lead welsh hunter too but we didn't put it, i didn't feel the need to put that in so this is children's ridden this is their first class ridden class they didn't start the ridden classes until oh, after four it was close to five i think when they did this it was such a long day and because it was all so late everything was so rushed in the afternoon there wasn't a class where you got to work on the ring and do a workout so they only worked on the ring in this which um you know she ended up a bit bunched up and there wasn't any room to spread yourselves out <coughs> and yeah it was just not the best situation but anyway they went around he behaved himself for his first ridden class in, in, in an indoor so that was good Lily rode him well and they were placed fourth in this class at the end of it. In ring two, we currently have our champion and reserve champion ribbon section A. Can we please have class 106, our novice section B, on standby? That is competitors. 65. This is the ridden Welsh Hunter section D class, and we just went straight in and lined up and worked out in this one. We didn't work on the ring beforehand. So Lily rode him in Childs and did the lead classes because I can't run at the best of times, but you know, my knee, I'm still not very good at it. So when I can avoid it, I will. I bet I also like my pony. So I ride him or rode him in the Ridden Welsh Hunter and the Ridden Section D. And yeah, this is the Welsh Hunter workout, which he did quite nicely. He, had not very much room to do a half decent hand gallop but we gave it a crack. This will be held by the completion 
of the champion and reserve champion of ribbon section of being in ring two. So it must have been all right anyway because we placed first in the Welsh Hunter class, which was lovely. This is the champion and reserve champion, Ridden Welsh Hunter. So it's not in separate sections. They have the first and second place getters from each class. And there was one class from each section and a stallion, but I don't think there were any stallions. So anyway, there was seven or eight of us on the ring working all together for champion, which was fun. And um, at some point soon, we need to do a hand gallop one at a time when the judge asks us to which is all a bit wild but they were so late and it was they were just trying to get through it I think it was after six by this time and off I go to do my hand gallop and went to go to the outside and got cut off so we had to pull to the inside and I threw him off balance and he threw in a lovely flying change there so that was it it was all over for us for Champion Hunter, which was very disappointing, but it is what it is, it's how it goes sometimes. So this is the Ridden Section D gelding class. This is our last class of the day. It was very late. It was close to seven o'clock by now. And I think they were just trying to get through it and be done with it. Um, we just worked on the ring. We didn't get the opportunity to work out in this one either. And we ended up with second place in this. So that was the end of our Tamworth adventure. We were very disappointed not to be sitting around eating cheese and drinking cider at three o'clock in the afternoon. But anyway, we had a nice weekend and we'll go from the, go on from there and see what happens at the next show. We've travelled up with my friend Mel. This is her Section D stallion, Trevelyan Firefly. It was their first show in Australia, which was very exciting, and he won champion Section D stallion. We stayed in Tamworth on the Saturday night too and headed off on Sunday morning for the trip home into the lovely M1 traffic, which was stop-start. Not just here near Sydney where it always is, but all the way from Morissette. So that was lovely, but anyway, Reese was happy to get home and go and have a roll in the paddock. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.